Hey everyone, it's Makeup Sparkles 44 here, and I am very excited because I'm going to be doing my second OOTD, and um, going to be showing you um, a makeup look for kind of like a churchy type of thing because I am going to church today, um, and I'm really excited about showing you guys this look. I'm not really excited about the church thing, but I'm excited about this look. Um, one of you requested that I do. Um, another OOTD, so I thought I would, and show you guys my outfit for church. It's not exciting, but it's done and done. <laughs> so first, I've got this dress on that I got. I don't really know where I got it at, but this is the dress that looks like this. And I'm actually thinking of picking a scarf out to wear, probably my white one to wear on it, like, this because I think that'd be really pretty and cute, kind of wrap it around like that. But um, because I don't know, I just think that'd be a really cute look. I never thought of that, but I don't think sure. So, <laughs> anyways, yeah, that's my look. I'm not wearing any shoes right now, but yeah, that's my look. And so now I will be showing you the makeup look to achieve for this, and I will also have time maybe to do my hair, but I will probably show you the hair, me straightening my hair after in another video because. Um, I don't have time in under 10 minutes, so um, let's get started. So first, I will be taking, of course, my favorite Dream Liquid Mousse Foundation. And I just ordered online the Makeup Forever, so I should get that pretty soon. Wow, it's like going on glops. Never know, but yeah, it's pretty natural lighting right now. It's not my favorite. It's not very good, but this is also not a very good... Um, lighting type of thing. So first I will be taking my Bare Essentials um, blush brush, but I'm actually going to be using it for my foundation. And pat that all over. And I'm get that all over my skin. Kind I like to get it in my hairline and stuff. Because I feel like that um, add a little something to it. I think it's just better that way. So let's get it in my hairline. But I'm, of course, not wearing my um, headband today. But, uh, yeah, let's just keep going. <laughs> Sorry, there's a mirror above me right now. This isn't my exact shade because I guess I've gotten lighter. But once I go to Arizona for the summer, well, some of the summer, not all of it, I'm going to go see my cousins in Arizona, which I will be still filming videos, but it will have to be when I'm alone because... My cousins, um, it would just be embarrassing <laughs> for me. Not that I'm embarrassed of making YouTube videos, it's just that I just wouldn't want them to see particularly. Um, so I'll still make them, but it'll have to be like when I'm alone and I won't be able to talk as much, of course. But, um, yeah, so that's what it made in the brush, so... Yeah. Um, oh, it got all over my hand, too, but... Alright. Then, I'm just going to be taking a little bit of coverage. Oh, I just got my computer. Sorry, guys. I'm going to put this away. But just for a little bit of coverage, I'll be using my other foundation with SPF 15. So it has a little bit of um, power in there for, like, <clears throat> some blockage. <laughs> so just a little touch up to make sure this stays on all day. And I reached the tin, and I finally know what Project 10 Pan is, but um, I'm not going to do it for a while until I get more subscribers, because I think that's... No. Then I will be taking my, of course, my concealer that I always use. <clears throat> Just so it looks like I've gotten some sleep, plus my allergy thing, it's like a mess, so... Alright, and I will not be putting Urban Decay Primer Potion on this time because I actually have a color tattoo, which is kind of like a ma uh, MAC paint, a MAC dupe, but it's a 24-hour um, super stay, so. Alright, so I'm just going to be patting that, patting, patting, patting that. <laughs> Make sure that's pretty well blended. And then the other eye. 
Sorry guys, I make really weird faces. Yeah, I'll have to do my straightening video in another video, obviously. I'll have to do my knee straightening my hand in another video. Just be easier that way, anyway. So, that's what I'm looking at right now. Okay. And then I will be taking <clears throat> my L'Oreal Paris um, lipstick in Tropical Coral 44. And it actually has kind of like a scent to it. So it's 44. Focus. Um, it actually has a little bit of a scent to it. See, it looks like this. I'll do a little swatch for you. Better do it on this hand. So, so it looks like this. It's really pretty pigmented, um, corally, pinkish color. I really like it a lot. So I already applied my um, my thingy thing, <laughs> chapstick. So I'll just be... But applying it like so. And as you can see, I'm getting everything dirty with my foundation hands. I'm going to hurry and wipe it with this cloth. <laughs> so, yeah. Um, Alright. Um, okay, I got everything dirty. Um, now I will be taking... Sorry, guys. Alright. Now I will be taking my... Um, Color Tattoo 24 Hour um, by iStudio. It looks like this. It's a really, really pretty shimmery um, matte. No, it's not matte. It's more like telescopic. I can't explain it. And it's in color Bad to the Bronze. I will be taking my e.l.f. makeup brush. And I will just be getting that all over the brush. And then putting it all over my eyelids. It's, it's kind of hard because the mirror is kind of far away from where I am. But I'll just kind of be patting and sweeping that on my lid. Like that. Then I just will be using the same one. I won't dip it in for a little bit because it's actually pretty pigmented all by itself without, you know, dipping it in another brush. But, um... Yeah, this is mainly my everyday type of look. I don't use this 24-7, but I use it quite a bit. So, <laughs> um, And then I will be taking my MAC. Hold on. Then I will be taking my MAC um, color right here. And this is in Mythology. I'll be getting my blending brush. This is my smoky eye brush, but I'll be using it for this look. This is my fluffy brush. Just getting that on there. And it's pretty sparkly. So anyways, I'll be getting that into the crease of my eye. To make it look clean when I am done. So, all my neighbors just got home. They're really mean. <laughs> all right. So just getting that all over the lid. Okay. Then kind of just get this side of the brush and just kind of blend that out a little bit. Just kind of get it in there. And then I will be taking um, my classic Volume Express Mascara. And this has, oh, I'm running out of time, this has a really funky wand. I kind of bent it on accident, but just get that all over the lid. Not the lid, but your eyelashes. I like to wiggle the brush up a little bit. And then the other side, I blink when I do it because it's just I find it's just easier that way. Okay, then I will be taking that zoom lash and getting it all over there, but I'm running out of time, so I gotta hurry. And then I will be curling them. I curl it after the mascara because I find that it curls better, but I'm going to do that. And I will see you in the next video when I do my hair. Okay, bye everyone.